So Brian, what are we doing here, man? Well, uh, hopefully we're making a movie. Yeah, what's it gonna be about? Nothing too serious. <laughs> For the record, I would like to say that she's, I, I've only known her for five minutes, but I'm fairly certain she's not one of them. One of them told me to get a life. I'm sorry, sir, if you're out there watching this, this is my life. I was born here just like you. This is what democracy looks like. We are the younger generation that is coming to take over, but we're the ones who are going to be continuing living in this world while Trump's generation is not going to be here for as long as we are. Your opinions may be different from mine and that you may be Bernie, I may be Trump or vice versa. As long as we realize that we're Americans and we have rights to live and have our opinions and we don't resort to violence against each other, I'm, I'm happy with the democratic process. You're supposed to pay taxes, but you're supposed to get something back. You can't catch up to the rest of the world on equal. We've got to have the best schools, the best teachers, in order to get in and and get our, our kids educated so they can be a, a, a productive citizens of this country. We're all fighting for liberation in some way, shape, or form, to be free. Right? And dialogue is the next step to liberation. So I think we're on the way there, and I think the candidates need to talk about it. I encourage others, whoever you're voting for, to have critical thinking skills about the impact, the impact of what your political candidate will have on the world. Not just you, not just your community, but the world. We've had the same thing for so long. Any change would be exciting, and this feels like this could happen. And I think they, I think people are, uh, they're plugging into that. They're plugging into that. They, they realize it's an important time. It's a section in a history book you're going to read about later on and say, I was there. You know, it's a Woodstock, if you will, on just a concert level. You know, you didn't know at the time. Turns out to be a significant concert. And I think this election is going to be that awesome. So, Darren, what did you learn from this whole thing? I think we learned that... Uh... We all have common ground that there's something wrong in this country and the only thing that we disagree on is how to fix it.